Hello everybody, welcome back to more New World. In this one I'm going to show you guys how you can get yourself some Watercrest stem. Now, I feel like I should warn you guys that you do need to have 30 harvesting for this. So if you are needing it to create the corruption concoction, or tincture, I can't remember exactly what it's called now. Uh, for the quest you may actually need to buy some from the marketplace or go and level your... Uh, harvest to skill up. If you guys want me to do like a, a how to level your harvesting skill up early on, um, let me know in the comments and maybe I'll, maybe I'll try and get something else, something like that sword. Either way, let's zoom out on where we are here. So, uh, we are in the Everfall zone right now. And before we get into the route that I'm about to show you, I feel like it's worth noting that uh, anywhere along this river here, uh, and even at the bends here like this, around this pond, uh, you can actually get the watercress stem um, along here, but this is where I see it spawning um, in in the densest of areas. So this is why I'm going to use this for the video. Um, you can find it around other ponds as well. There should be some around here. There should be some around this pond and this pond. Like there's little bits around, but if you want to actually like kind of get some for like crafting potions and stuff, then I feel like this is going to be the place that you want to that you want to visit. Unless of course it's like massively busy, then maybe you want to find a different place. Um, but either way, uh, this has good access to the uh, to the fast travel just there. And we're going to start at the southern area. And basically, it will be on the sides of this river, uh, fit fairly densely, and you guys will see as we go, uh, up till about where this um, bend is just here. So let's get into this. Obviously, we'll start at the first one here. Um, oh, if, I don't pick <laughs> if I don't pick the flint up instead. Okay, so if you've got a keen eye, you can probably see we've already got the second one straight across there. So I'm going to go ahead and cross the river. Okay, so one dead croc left. We're going to get crafting. Obviously, I didn't mean crafting. In fact, we are gathering. And as you guys can see, we have another one pretty much straight across again. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to cross the river and then go along to avoid too much fighting. See you all shortly. Okay, so with that one done then, let me just check where we're going next. Okay, it's carrying on. We are going to go past the bridge. I've already left a waypoint as to where the next set should be. Uh, we should get a few of them all together. There we go. Looking good. Okay, so a little bit further forward then, we can go ahead and start gathering some more. Might as well skip to when I've harvested the third of these, as you can see. And there's even more further up the stream. Okay, that's the third one of those ones gathered. We're going to make our way over to the next one back across the stream. Look. Give me some more river crests. Okay, now we're going to continue. Uh, might as well skip forward the next two. So we'll grab that one, and then I'll meet you guys at the third one just there. Okay then, so with that one done, we're going to try and avoid battling here. Uh, and as you guys can see, there's another one straight up that way. Uh, and I believe there should be another one on this side of the river as well. So again, I'll meet you guys over there. Okay, so with that one then, we are now able to pass over on to the next one, just up there. Cool. And this will be the last one for the run. So, quite a bit of uh, of the watercrest stems you can get there. Again, if you happen to be someone that's good at crafting, make sure you put some of these on the uh, on the trading. Uh, auction house thing so that people can can grab some if they don't actually have the, uh, the harvesting skill hopefully this has been helpful for you guys and i'll see you all in the next video